What's up, guys? Welcome back to Robux Talk. Today, I want to look at Rakim Jarrett, wide receiver, undrafted wide receiver out of Maryland. And you've heard nothing but good reviews from him all training camp. It's almost like an unquestioned thing that he's going to win uh, a spot on this roster. And it's pretty crazy considering how many good undrafted free agents this Buccaneer team has right now. But this is the first time you've actually seen him. The first game, preseason game, he was injured. But here he just has... Three big catches, three catches for 84 yards, 28 averages. So we're going to go over that right here. So pretty much he just wins at the line. They're in his own defense. He's going to sit in this wide open gap. And just John Wolford pretty much throws him open here. But I like the nice hands catch, elevates hands, and then gets his two feet down. And look who's here, Canales right here. Uh, Bowles right there. What a way to make an impression right there. Bowles trying to get out of the way. But I like the ability to sit in that zone, stop, elevate, hands catch it get the two feet down look where you're at and then secure the catch like a lot of good things there and here he pretty much wins immediately off the snap here so when you're looking at him over here he's at the top of your screen he's in a bunch here he's literally going to win initially here just by bringing his hands over top of the corners and then he just does a little corner route to the to the sideline so here i like that the initial getting that arm on top of the the corners arms there so he can't push him down and slow down his route and then it gets over top of him, sacks him. He's going, he gives a little bit of a head fake and then goes out to the sideline. I mean, he could have done a little bit more. You've seen Chris Godwin give a, a heavy fake inside just to bite that corner in. But still, either way, he sold it, gets open. He's wide the hell open. Look at him. Wolf, Wolford again, wide open, easy catch, secures it, gets down. But it's just simple things he's doing right. And he said it himself, like during the game, he's got to step up and not have any lazy, lazy drops. And he didn't have one in this game. And then nice little dance moves. You can't get can't get too fancy. It's preseason, guys. And this is the biggest catch of the day, pretty much. Like I love the the whole route itself. Double move. He's going for an out route, gives the head fake, and then goes out. So check it out. Let it break down. Goes right up to the the corner, turns. I like the head fake. There it is right there. He's actually looking for the ball, selling it to that, that corner to try and under undercut it, and then gets upfield. Look at the separation. That right there in the NFL, that is, that's a lot of separation. That's almost wide the hell open. Kyle Trask just needles that bad boy in there. The safety just about gets there. But it that's right there. Hands catches it, gets pummeled down, bangs his head. Doesn't matter. He caught the ball. He's excited. Everyone in the sideline is all excited as well. I mean, let's break this down even more. I mean, everything about that was flawless and effortless, too. Like the cut, out route, up. Yes, he could have sold out route a little bit more, but look at the separation he has there. He doesn't have crazy speed. He just has good enough speed. But the route running, the hands, you can see it all on, those, on this display there. Here, Todd Bowles laughed about it. He's doing a little end around. He's going to be confronted by a cornerback. He's going to try and jump over him instead of go around him or through him. Here he is, athlete in space. What are you going to do? Make him miss? I'm going to try and jump over you. Todd Bowles later said, I didn't teach that, so don't do that again. So I don't think you're going to see him trying to jump over people. It's not high school or college no more. And then here we just have him in the running game. Uh, you just want to see some effort. Give me some effort. You're not going to be Chris Godwin. Not many people are. But get in there. Get your head dirty inside the, the running game aspect of it. Because that's that's how you're going to see the field too. Like if you can't block at all, they're not going to put you in there. And that shows willingness. And he's driving guys through. But other than that, guys, what do you think of Rakim Jarrett? Like he's almost a shoe in to make the roster, which I think is – a little crazy, but it's is he just that good? Uh, let us know down below. Uh, hit the like button. Uh, that helps support the channel, help, helps the algorithm get going. Other than that, guys, subscribe if you haven't just yet. And with that said, until the next one.